People have made a lot of crazy stuff in Animal Crossing. We have toured a lot of things on the channel, and of course, my island is the embodiment of pushing the boundaries. But little did we know that we were betraying Nintendo this whole time. This sort of tomfoolery is not what the game is about. It is something much, much different. Today, we are playing Animal Crossing the way Nintendo wanted us to play it. Now, the first thing we need to do is remod our island. Obviously, guys, obviously. Let me let you in on a little bit of a secret. This right here, th this, this thing, is not what an Animal Crossing island is supposed to look like. Now, what is an Animal Crossing island supposed to look like? Well, in order to find out, who better to go to than the master themselves? This right here is by science the perfect Animal Crossing island, the best island ever created because this here is Nintendo's sure. island. Man, look at these flowers. Look at how they move the pathway around the around the flower. It's it's too much for my mind to handle. Look at the stump too. The stump placed in the pathing. Chef kiss. Chef kiss. Individual villager yards treating every villager with respect. Every villager gets equal space on the island. That's how it should be. Flowers, they get their own space on the island. That's how it should be. Mr. Duck gets his own coloration of pathing. That's how it should be. And they use every single coloration of fencing, even this weird violet color. That's how it should, you know what, you know what? I, I, I can't do it anymore. I, I can't pretend that. This is garbage. Now, Nintendo's Island has some stuff going for it, but I feel like the person who made that island isn't the same creator that made the islands in the trailers. And I feel like some of the islands in the trailers are actually pretty good. So I'm going to go ahead and recreate some of the builds from the trailers. Obviously, we have to get some inspiration. So I picked out the best trailer that Animal Crossing has ever created, the winter trailer. And if we go ahead and look at this build, look at this. Just enjoy. Just enjoy this. Look at this beautiful creation right here. This is one of the best creations I've ever seen in Animal Crossing, and it came from a trailer. If we go ahead and build something like this, something exactly like this, we will be playing Animal Crossing the way Nintendo wants us to be playing it. Alright, your boy cleared some space. It's just, a, it's just a little bit of space. And I'm going to be transforming this into something that looked like that trailer. Now, obviously it's not winter. Obviously... Uh, some of those items were a little bit different. I'm just gonna make it look a little bit like that I don't want to spend hours on this. I don't want to spend time on this I'm just gonna make it make whatever I can in about like five minutes We'll see how it goes. The first thing we got to do is get rid of this hideous pathing We got to get out the good stuff the Nintendo pathing right here. That's where the real style is. Oh Yeah, oh yeah, that's so much better Oh my goodness, okay, okay, finally. We did it, we did it. We got it all set up, we got all the pathing done. Now what do we do? Now we gotta place some items around. We gotta do some fencing, some trees. I don't know, we're just gonna figure it out. I think in the trailer they had a few trees back here, and then we'll put one on the other side, just like this. That's symmetry. Nice. You always gotta have that symmetry in Animal Crossing. I'll put another tree right here, just for good keeping. We're putting trees everywhere, that's how it goes. Three hours later. Bam, trees. Now we gotta go with fencing. The iron and stone fence is gonna be our ticket to success. Just look at this. Just look at this. Oh my goodness. It's- it's amazing. It, it's beautiful. it's- it's beautiful. Bam! Fencing! Now we do some lights. Bam! Lights! And now we're just gonna fill it in and finish everything off. Let's go! Bam! Here we go. We topped it off. I think it looks pretty good. I just put some items in there. I just crammed them all in. Hopefully it looks a little bit like the Nintendo one. Obviously I couldn't use Christmas items because it's not holiday on my island, but uh, I think it came out decent. I'm not gonna spend any more time on it. I'm not gonna spend hours and hours, as I said, but it is pretty good. I know, I know. What can I say? I was inspired. So now that we got our island looking like a textbook Animal Crossing island, what do we do? Uh. I mean, I don't even know. That's the question. So I went to the Nintendo website for help. Apparently we were supposed to talk to our villagers, garden, fish, decorate, hunt for fossils, and more. Oh my goodness, this game's complicated. Nintendo wants us to talk to villagers, eh? I'm gonna talk to my favorite villager, my favorite homeboy, Timmy and Tommy Nook. Dang. Rejected. Why? Why is it so hard to make friends? Now I'm thinking about gardening. I'm thinking about some fresh fruit, but I know what Nintendo would want me to do. They don't want me to pick my fruit on my island. They don't want me to grow fruit trees. They want me to go to the place where you can get the best fruit in all of Animal Crossing.
Hey there, Captain. There it is, the finest fruit in the world. The player takes the closest step to the Holy Grail. He shakes the tree for its bouncy. He grabs it. Run there, player, run. Faster, faster you must go. What a great worthwhile trip. Good thing cherries are my indigenous fruit as well. Man, this is great. Me, myself, my fruit, and my remodeled island. What more could you ask for? I mean, this is what it's all about. Relaxation just like that? Even without hopping on flight, you'll meet a cast of charming animal residents bursting with personality. Hello there, Blathers. What's up? What's up, my guy? Dang, rejected. I want to get a cup of coffee. Oh my goodness. It's Kit Kat. It's my arch rival. This is this is what it's all about. This is what Nintendo wanted. Oh, pour that pigeon milk in there. Yes. That's what it's all about. All right, I'm going to be honest. We followed all the rules. We did everything in the blurb, basically, that it says to do. I think we kind of mastered playing Animal Crossing to the rules. I think we need a bit of a challenge. We need to go hard mode. We're jumping to the additional content, guys. Hey, guys, it's Happy Home Paradise. We got Mr. Monkey and Dodo Bird here. Not even joking. This might be the best day I've ever had in Happy Home Paradise. Look at this. We got Gonzo. We got Pansetti. Is this, is this Pansetti? It's Maggie. Oh my goodness, even better. What an upgrade. What an upgrade. That was clutch. We got, uh, 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 it's, uh, we got, uh, blue, blue dino nice. here. We got, uh, Lionel. All right, first, just like the other thing, I want to get some inspiration from the trailer so we can build something exactly like what Nintendo wanted us to build. Ooh. Pick which one ah. To use to start designing. Yeah, I, I see that. That's quite nice. Create depth by that is quite lines. nice. Oh, they got multi-lights. Multi-lights, they got the wallpaper. Oh my goodness! Oh gosh! Alright, we're using Gonzo for this. We're doing it for Gonzo. Look at that zebra back there. Man, I must have made her happy. Look at that. Look at those moves. She's getting sturdy with it. Wait, hold up, guys. Hold up, hold up. Hey. 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 He wants a glamping home, so I picked an Australian-looking desert because he is Australian, mate. I'm, I'm never gonna do that again. Put another shrimp on the bobby, young man. I can't contain myself. Now we're on the inside, man. I really want to do something, but I can't. We gotta keep it simple. We, got, we gotta keep it practical. It's just so hard when you look at his face. Hello there. Hey, you know what isn't hard, though? Subscribe to the channel. Only a small portion of people who watch these videos are subscribed, so go ahead and click on that subscribe button right there. It's, uh, it's right there for you to click on, so go ahead and click on that if you enjoy the content. Well, anyways, let's get back to it. All right, I finished, I finished, I think. I think it looks good. I think it looks sort of like what Nintendo might make. Let me go ahead and give you guys a little bit of a tour here. So you start off, it's an Aussie house, right? So we go here, we got a little bit of a, a storefront in here for some reason. We have a simple little, a simple little table. We got some vines everywhere. We got a bathroom. I kept it pretty simple, guys. I actually did it. Usually I go overkill on these things, but I only spent a little bit of time and it looks sort of like Something from the trailer. Obviously, they didn't do a style similar to this. With this being done, I think we did all things in the Animal Crossing blurb on the Animal Crossing website, which means we beat Animal Crossing the way Nintendo wanted us to beat it. Let's go! I feel relaxed, just like they said. Just like they said. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, like button and subscribe. And that's it. Until next time, Nook News out!